Well guys, I'm sure as you've seen in the newest update, they killed Star Guns, my most beloved build. But on the bright side, I have a new build to show you guys today, and I'm not the first one to make it, I'll admit that. It originally comes from a guy called Lean Drill, but I wanted to make the build because it looked fun, and it's probably going to get nerfed anyways, so... Like, let, let's be honest, if Star Guns is going to get nerfed, this build's absolutely gone after this video. Because this build can absolutely solo anything in the entire game at ease. So let's get right into the video. Alright, so basically this build is a Hex Blade build, but we don't actually use Hex. We're really only using the Hex Blade and this handle for healing on a hit, which we get from every tornado that we can put down. And we can put down a lot of tornadoes as you can see. Oh yeah, we're also the race that has a weapon art cooldown reduction, so I don't remember what it's called, but pick that one. We also went Night Guild, but apparently Vamp also works, so whichever one you like more. I, I went Night because I was testing, and it just works really well still. Alright, both Blade and Handle you want are fairly straightforward. You want to do the quest to unlock the Hex Blades, and then you just go down the side. That is not summoning, you just go down normal Hex and you'll get to the ones that you want. As you can see on the screen, I'm, I'm kind of clicking through which ones you want to upgrade. And you'll get to this big great sword with the eyes on it. You want that one because it does weakening and it makes your weakening last longer. And then for your handle, you want to go down, you know, just normal hex. Do not go down summoning once again. Just go down normal hex. You want to get all the way to the cursed steel handle. And this one is what makes you heal on hit. Alright, well it's not exactly heal on a hit yet, but it heals whenever you hit someone that has a debuff, which is why you want to have the weakening blade with long lasting weakenings. Okay, now for the armor and other gear that you want to wear. You want to have a lucky ring, and you want to have the full king khaki set, and you also want to infuse full king khaki, and also make everything windy. And you want a launch rune also, for more wind boost. That's about it for the build though, you know, you just max out your night guild and stuff, but now I'm gonna show you me uh, soloing a frog dungeon that is corrupted on two diff. 